Okay, this is not a trick. I just want you to uh, look at these three cards. Two of these cards show pictures of a goat, and the third car show, card shows pictures of a car. And all I'm going to do is I'm going to, I'm going to shuffle around the table and just ask you to choose a card at random and try and find the car for me. Okay? So there's the three cards. Who's going to go first? Try to pick a card? I mean, no, 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 don't look at it. Don't look at it. Don't okay, look at it. okay. No, no, just, just choose a card. Okay. okay. Did you look at it? Did you see what no, it no, no, no. No, okay. We'll take your word for it. Okay. okay. We trust you. Now, if I show you another card, okay, it's a goat. Mm -hmm. Do you want to stay with the card that you chose first time round, or do you want to switch to the other card? Um, I think I want to stick with that. You want to stick with that, okay. You chose that one. I'm afraid you're wrong. <laughs> okay. You should have switched. Okay. <laughs> Okay, do you want to go? No, you just choose a card. Choose this one. Okay, I'm going to show you a card. Okay, I'm going to show you a goat. Do you want to stick with the card that you had? Or do you want to switch to the, the one that's left? I'll stick to what I have. You want to stick? You chose that card? There you are, you were right. Okay, so you stuck and you were wrong. You stuck and you were right. Okay, let's see what happens next. You can play this game at home. Perfectly safe. All you need is three pieces of paper. <laughs> Okay, sir. Do you want to choose a card? You want to choose that one? Yep. Okay. I will cho choose. <coughs> I will show you a picture of a goat. Do you want to stick, or do you want to switch? I'll stick. You want to stick as well, are you? Okay. <laughs> You're wrong. Too. Okay. Now we we played it three times. Okay. You all decide to stick. Why did you all decide to stick? <coughs> Um, just to prove that I'm right. You're right, okay. That's good reasons. <laughs> a lot of people say that. They don't want to stick. They don't want to change because they've already made their choice and they don't think they should change it. Why did you stick? I stick because um, I, I guess it's just a, a habit. Even when you're doing multiple choices, they say, stay, always stay with your first answer. Yeah. What if I say to you that if you were to change every time, if you were to switch, you would double your chances of winning? In other words, if you play this game lots and lots of times, you would win twice as often if you switched as if you stick. Double your chances of winning. Okay, does that sound right? Well, shall we I try don't know. And, shall we try and work out why? They're three cards, mm -hmm. they're all face down so you couldn't see them. Mm -hmm. Your chance of choosing the car first time round? Uh, one over three. One in three, okay. The chance of choosing the car are one in three. I then take away a goat, I show you a goat, and ask if you want to switch. Should you switch? No, of course not, because you've already chosen the car. So when you chose the car first time, you should stick. And the chance of that are one in three. Mm -hmm. And then when I took a, a, a goat away mm -hmm. and gave you a chance to switch, should you have switched? Mm. Well, no, because you chose the car first time. You've already got the car. Mm -hmm. One time in three, you should stick with the car because you've already got it. Mm -hmm. But let's suppose you'd chosen one of the goats the first time round. What's the chance of choosing one of the goats first time round? Two in three. There's right. two goats. So two mm -hmm. in three times you choose a goat. I show you the other goat. So now should you stick or switch? Exactly. Now you should switch because the other card is the car. Okay. So when you chose the car first time round, you were right to stick. But it's only one in three times. When you chose a goat the first time, you're right to switch. And that's two in three times. Okay. So if we played this game lots and lots of times, mm -hmm. you would win twice as often if you switched as if you'd stuck. <laughs> okay. Shall we do it again? Mm -hmm. Okay, do you like to choose a card, sir? No, 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 no don't it. Just, just leave it. Okay, okay, okay. I'm going to show you that card, which is a goat. Do you want to stick with that card? Or do you want to switch to that card? The probability is that I should switch. The probability is that you should switch, and you would be right to do so, <laughs> yes. One more? Okay, do you like to choose a card, sir? This one. Okay, I'm going to show you a goat. Would you like to switch or would you like to stick? Go with the odds. Yeah, I'm going to switch. Okay, you go with the odds? Yeah. And you're right. <laughs> <laughs> okay. You switch, you win two times in three. Yeah. Over a long number, not every time, but twice as often you, you win as if you stick. A very eminent um, American mathematician called Marilyn von Sand was asked to analyse this problem and say whether you should switch or stick. And she said, you double your chances by switching. And she had a, a, a post bag full of letters from um, American professors of, uh, of mathematics and people who just said she was wrong. You know, how could she possibly say this? And actually, she's right, you, you gain by switching.